I'm Roger Jury, Managing Director, Owner, Proprietor, Slipper Maker. Bowhill and Elliot was established in 1874 and I'm very proud that our slippers are the finest in the market. I get a buzz out of working with customers like Herring Shoes. Working with them to develop a product that is individual to them. The colours are put together by Adrian Herring to create a striking look for each slipper. The growth uh, of the product, particularly with Herring, has been quite extraordinary. It's become quite a desirable product. People wear them at home to entertain summer balls. They wear them for their weddings. People wear them for all sorts of occasions. The, the cotton velvet is sent to be hand embroidered with the gold bullion wire. Once the embroidery has been done, we start to make the slipper. We would start with a clicking. and We're cutting the cotton hand embroidered uppers in the satin linings, in the socks, the black leather seats with the herring crest. The next stage is to incorporate the toe puff that maintains the integrity of the toe and the upper. The lining is closed to the cotton velvet upper. The upper is finished by a process of binding using a fabric tape. Next is the lasting process. We marry up the correct size last and attach and incorporate the insole, which is the foundation of the slipper. And then incorporate the heel counter stiffener. Next is the toe lasting. The process starts by putting the partly lasted upper and the last in the heat cabinet to soften the toe puff. We wrap the upper around the last and then hand tack in place to position it straight on the last. We complete the seat, which is the heel. The toes are trimmed and pleated to finish a nice toe edge. And then the slipper is applied with an adhesive ready for attaching the sole. The sole is fitted to the slipper on the last and then goes into air press to apply a large amount of pressure so the sole is well stuck to the slipper. We attach the heel with sturdy pins so that the heel can't come detached. Next we incorporate the quilted sock with the leather seat and then a final inspection, brush the velvet, making sure everything is absolutely perfect. It's then ready for the customer. A large amount of hand work and hand craftsmanship is incorporated into the slipper. Years of experience and years of pride in producing a high quality British product.